Hello. Today we're going to take a look at partial derivatives. This concept is the calculus building block for economics 10a. To start, let's analyze this function. We have some function which relies on two variables, x and y. In order to take a partial derivative, we will take the derivative with respect to only one of these variables, leaving the other as a constant so long as there's multiplication involved. To start, let's look at the partial derivative of function f with respect to x. Our standard notation would look something like this, the partial derivative of function f with respect to x. We're going to take the exponent attached to variable x, in this case 1 half, and drop it down to be multiplying by the variable instead. As we do this, we will subtract 1 from that exponent and make that our new exponent for that variable. That would look something like this, 1 half x to the negative 1 half. As I said before, we will leave variable y as a constant in this case. That means y to the 1 half should be multiplying by this new x term. If we would like, we can simplify this given that there's a negative exponent in our equation. To do so, we can make this y to the 1 half over 2 x to the 1 half. That would be our final answer for the partial derivative of function f with respect to x. We can do the same thing for variable y. In order to do so, we'll say the partial derivative of function f with respect to y is equal to, and then we'll do the same thing as before. We're going to drop down this 1 half, multiply by our new y term, by subtracting 1 from our exponent. So we're left with 1 half y to the negative 1 half. And we can't forget to multiply by this x to the 1 half, which again, we treat as a constant. In order to simplify, we would say x to the 1 half over 2 y to the 1 half. This would be our partial derivative with respect to variable y. 